Jackie Hetze, a longtime advocate for women's football at the Namibia Football Association, has described the death of President Gengob as a deeply saddening event for the country and the whole world in general. The death of the president came to her like a thief in the night as she did not expect the country to lose a son of the soil so soon. It just hits you so hard to know that the person who is totally on top is your first family of the country. The head of that house is gone. And, and immediately that emotion crept in. And uh, you, you, you feel scared. You know, when, 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 your, when your parents leave you, even if you're an adult, you already feel scared. How is it going to be? You know, imagine the the first family of the country. It's the head of the country. It's the father of the country that has left. Now that feeling was, was, is very bad. Up till today, uh, I, don't, I, I haven't recovered. Monica Shapwa, a prominent figure who serves on the NFA Council, says the late president was a unique figure in the contemporary history of the Namibian people. According to Shapwa, on sport level, the president leaves a void that is difficult to fill. The loss of our first citizen is a big loss to the country. We have lost a giant. We have lost a president that believed in women empowerment. You'll see from a corporate perspective, you see in parliament is appointed youth and really has been an inspiration. He was somebody that was very passionate about football. And uh, you will still recall in uh, 20, 2006 when you had our first women's Afghan, he supported us, he was always there. And uh, he really, really did a lot for women's football. Not that, uh, directly, but um, indirectly by trying to make sure that we get the opportunity in this country through legislations and all that. Besides being passionate about sport, the late president played football as a hard-tackling defender for the Tosha Lions in Sumeb, as can be seen here in this photo from back in the day. He also loved English football club Liverpool. <laughs>